This vlog isn't going anywhere. <laughs> Hi guys, I don't really have a plan for this video, but I figured vlogs, most of them that you see aren't planned, so I guess I'll just roll with it. I literally don't have any creative ideas for this, but I have a flower crown, and uh, we're going to talk about movies, and mostly book adaptions. I have a few things to say about that, I guess. I guess that's going to be my thing on this channel for a while, is I'm just going to rant and talk about random things. Anyway, my one of my favorite book series, and yes, I'm in bed, right? So don't judge me, and don't ask why I'm wearing a flower crown, because I'll tell you, it's because I look like butt, and the flower crown makes it bearable. Aragon. Don't judge it by its movie because the books are so good. They are fantastic, but the movie made it ass, to be honest. Made it just awful. They took the story, they messed it up, and it really pissed me off. So, and I notice Hollywood does that to a lot of movies. Like they'll take a really good book and they'll mess it up. And I love books. Stuff to wish, by the way. They did well with Harry Potter, and to be honest, Lord of the Rings they did pretty well with. But Aragon they ruined. Percy Jackson, they didn't entirely ruin it, but they messed it up a lot. And it kind of makes me sad, because what are they doing to these wonderful books but ruining their stories and their core messages? Anyway, also, what is with all these reboots of shows that I had growing up? Like, the Powerpuff Girls are ruined. Teen Titans is a bust. I hope they don't mess up Samurai Jack or in the Danny Phantom one that's going to be coming up. Hopefully. But I could rant for hours on the, if y'all remember a movie called Spirits Die Another Cimarron. It was my favorite movie growing up. Still is one of my favorite movies to this day. DreamWorks decided to make a Netflix series about it, and they took this beautiful movie about the American West and the relations between the Native Americans and the settlers and, you know, stuff about like what it means to be free and this wild horse that only, only one person could ever ride him and that's because he truly trusted him and all this. And the movie like embodied the spirit of the West. They took it and the trailer they made it look like another, like a horse girl club. Like it's just a bunch of girls riding horses and Spirit happens to be one of those horses. And that really pisses me off because they kind of took the core message of the film and said, you know what, you know what we need? Another TV series about horses and girls who love horses. Like I distinctly remember the opening line of that trailer for the series was, there are two types of girls in this world. Girls who like horses and girls who love horses. I was like, Ugh, how cringe can you get? Don't ruin my favorite movie. Don't do what you did to the Lion King with the Lion Guard. Don't do that. I don't know where this vlog is going. It's gonna be weird, but you know. I'll probably film some more in the morning because I have like a total of five minutes recorded right now. I have some late night ramblings. I'll think of more to talk about in the morning. Bye. I'm gonna have Michelle edit most of that out.